are you chewing? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, I'll start. <laughs> Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. I just set the camera up and my husband puts a pops up tomato in his mouth and I could hear him chewing. <laughs> I told him I was probably going to mention him. He's here today and um, some days I do the video and it's all done and he just hears the replay when I'm when I'm putting it into the computer and then I have him watch it because it's important that he watches to see what I've done. Well today I'm going to um, just it's going to have some inserts. I'm going to put a little bit of, I showed you the garden. I showed um, the rain. I don't know what all I showed you. I, I'm sure I, I will show you what I showed you. Whatever it was I did earlier. I um, went outside for just a little bit and I did eat some gooseberries but I didn't bring you over there. The gooseberries are now ready to eat. They're still uh, they're, they're not super sweet, but they're, they're, I like them when they're on the, on the not-so-sweet side. The currants are almost all gone. The, the um, mulberry tree has no more mulberries. There's none on that. It's all gone. I would imagine the black raspberry should be getting close to being gone because usually by the middle of, of July, they're dwindling. And um, I don't know about blackberries because I haven't seen any of those around. I haven't found any, but um, I haven't looked either. So, and today, what did I do? What did I do? Hmm. I didn't do much of anything, but I did, um, I did lay down on the floor for a little while, and the dog laid down next to me. It was right around that darn bewitching hour for me, that 1 o'clock tired I'm still in the mode of, of nap for the with the kids sitting quiet for an hour an hour and a half and just sitting quiet and my body still thinks it's supposed to it still thinks it's supposed to wake up at 5:30 and it still thinks it's supposed to go to bed about nine o'clock so until I get out of that thought process it's going to continue but I did lay down for a little while I didn't take a nap though I didn't sleep I just rested and the dog sat next to me. I think he was enjoying the little time that he could sit by me because he wants to sit on my lap a lot. Now this video is getting kind of, I'm boring myself. <laughs> this is terrible. I've got to start over because this is not, mm, I'm going to start over. Cut, 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 cut. Be bad. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Feel a burp coming too. Duh. There it is. See, I knew I could feel it coming. Oh, it's, it's still, it's, it's still, you didn't turn it off. I thought you turned it off. I turned it off and back on again. <laughs> Oh man. Well, Charlie, I do burp. <laughs> I could feel it coming. Excuse me. <laughs> You're so terrible. <laughs> you can always cut it out. I probably will have to cut a lot out of it. Okay, we're going to start again, I think. <laughs> Hi everyone, this is Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. Today I'm going to show you some of the stuff that I looked at today while I was outside. It was a very, very hot day, hot and humid. It was, um, the temperature was probably 81, 82, but the humidity was 86, which is pretty darn high. And then it must have been 100% because we got a nice rainstorm. And um, then it stopped and the chickens came back out and um, now they're, they're not talking rain, but you can hear the highway out there, I think. I'm hearing the highway. I didn't shut the door. But um, I watched a few videos. And tomorrow is the day that if um, a, a B apostrophe S, the winner, I forgot. Can I have my notebook, Jim? 
I sent him a message, a private message, so that he, or I put a message on one of his messages, because he's, he's watched a couple of my videos, and I did, it was um, AB's Kitchen Recipe and Vlog, had won the, the flag, and I did send a message stating that he needed to send me an email, I have not received it yet, so tomorrow is Wednesday, and if I don't get it by the time I, I go to do my Thursday video, Actually, Wednesday night he has to get it to me. Um, but um, it will be the next person. And the next person is, I'm sure, going to be very happy to get a flag. So I will talk to you all again. Well, kind of watch my, my little video that I'm going to put in. And then I'll come back. Because I don't want to say goodbye yet. I'm going to share a little bit of my garden. These are the peppers that we planted when it looked really scantly. And now we've got some hot peppers on the plants. It's time for me to pick some hot peppers. I don't know what kind those are. Those are really hot and spicy. These are the Hungarian hots and they're really good. They're doing good. That's all I planted this year was peppers, basically. I also planted peas, and the peas are starting to get their pods. Now last year, now last year I saved seeds. And this is lettuce seeds that I saved. And this is the pods. This year I'm going to save some again. These grew by themselves. This is lettuce that grew by itself. And in these pods that are drying out, there's um, these black seeds. The lettuce seeds are in there. And that's what I plan to um, harvest. I'm also waiting for this plant. This is the, the butter lettuce. I like the butter lettuce the best and I'm letting it go to seed so that this year maybe I can get some of this kind. This is the kind I like. I like the butter lettuce and it's going to seed. This is the lettuce that grows from these seeds that I, that I have, the seeds that I have. Something's eating the lettuce now. It's looking pretty sad. But I give it to the chickens, so it doesn't matter that something's eating it. The chickens will eat it, and it's starting to go to, and this is when it's starting to go to seed. This rhododendron has never bloomed. This one I got from McDonald's. They had this plant there, and it never bloomed when it was there either. It gets huge. So I bought this one, and it had a bloom on it but it hasn't bloomed for me. So I don't know, maybe I just have the wrong kind of ground. I did give this plant food, but it still didn't bloom. I had some baby carrots and I brought them out for the chickens and they, they're they um, just about done eating them. They haven't wanted any more. And Mama Hen, I gave her some too. She calls her little babies over when she first had them put in. She's got them over in the corner. And they're still little. Oh, you've got some really dark feathers on your tail. They're a little one. And these are the little, they, they lay eggs. Those girls lay eggs. And where's the teens? And there's the other ones. They, I think the, I think the two, the, I think the white one, I think those two, whoops, the one that's got no tail, I think that's a rooster. I'm not sure. They all look like roosters to me right now. And then I've got two eggs so far. And one girl sitting in the nest. Okay, I'll leave you alone. She, whoops. She doesn't like to be bothered.
I was just watching Susie with Out West Homestead, and they've got dry, dry weather, and we've got rain galore. Look at this water. Oh, gosh. It's the what's coming off of the roof. I'm sure that Jim and Jessica would just love this water. We don't collect it. We have so much water right now, sogging the earth. In fact, the chickens, their little hole that they have is gonna be so mushy, mushy, unknown, as they say. It's like, hello, hello in, in Japanese, I think. But it's mushy, real mushy out there. And it's gonna be a muddier hole than what it was. But this is what we've got right now, rain, rain, rain. Look at the rain coming off the roof. You see it in the little gutter there. Okay, that's it for today. <laughs> he goes, you're on. <laughs> yes, I know I'm on. Um, that's it for today, and I will talk to you all again tomorrow when I, um, I plan to, tomorrow's Wednesday, yeah, no. Yeah, tomorrow's Wednesday. I'll talk to you tomorrow. And then Thursday, I'm thinking I might go to the fair. And um, I might bring the camera with me so you can see the commotion of all the people that are there and see what I see. But I'm not sure because I'm not sure if I want to hang on to something. So we'll talk to you later. Bye.